Yes, Wayne. Yo, What's up, man? Yes. Respect. No, nice to meet Finally you. Finally here, man. Finally. Yeah, Finally. a bit of traffic. Everyone's gone a bit mad with yeah, the fuel, weren't they? Yeah, with the fuel, with the petrol. Yeah. You Every... couldn't get none last night, though, could you? I couldn't even get none last night. It was this morning I had to go venture outside of my hometown just to get some yeah, fuel, yeah. but I'm here and I'm Obviously. happy I'm here. No, no, brilliant, man. Yeah. So, Toyota MR2, man, I'm yeah. pretty excited about today because yeah. uh, I've been trying to get out in one for a while. I grew up seeing these spinning up in car parks, drifting yeah. and... Obviously mid-engine. Yeah, mid-engine. Yeah, rear-wheel rear -wheel drive. drive. Yeah. And you say you've had four of these. Yes, this is my fourth one. I just love the rawness of the MR2. Yeah. A lot of modern cars, it's easy to go quick in there. Yeah. And easy to handle with, with all the electronics. But this, mm -hmm. you have to drive it. You've got to drive you it. you got to drive it. Yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> It's good, man. It's good because this is what I'm hearing recently. Yeah, Everyone's yeah. like, you know, people have got a choice of certain cars, exactly. but they like that raw, they exactly. want to drive it, you know? Exactly. Okay, and it's finished in... Uh, uh, is midnight it? Purple. Midnight Purple. Yeah. So this is like what you'd get on the R34s. R34. Yeah, it's yeah. nice, man. It's really deep. Like, And you've recently been sprayed? Yes, recently. The last last uh, three months has been sprayed three months yeah so how long have you owned it for that so i've only had it a couple months now so okay. about two months now yeah yeah so i bought it like this mm -hmm. tuned already so i right. didn't do any yeah, work yeah. myself but yeah. uh, because i've got a passion for cars when i saw it it was like yes i have to have it yeah because this is the most extreme mr2 i've driven right mr2 uh, so yeah, and it's, it's stroked you say yeah it's a 2.2 stroker right. i don't think there's another one in the uk but mm -hmm. if there is it's very the one very rare it. <laughs> yes <laughs> so so um you say engine was yeah, built from, and sent from, from america, america yeah? yes yeah. right so somebody would have just installed it over yes, here in the uk yeah, yeah? that's right you estimate horsepower to be uh 510 wow. dyno so it weighs about 1200 kilos yeah so that's yeah. gonna be you're gonna feel that performance isn't it? exactly <laughs> and i trust me you do feel yeah. it <laughs> and and what's it like is it sketchy like because no, they were known what? weren't they to sort of yeah so the earlier ones from 1989 mm -hmm. to 1992 they have uh issue with snap over steer right but later on uh toyota rectified that right so this got lsd as well lsd yeah okay. engine sent from america so it's forged forged pistons yeah. rods and stuff yeah, like that fully forged do you know if it's got an aftermarket ecu or yes it's got apex um aftermarket okay. ecu they actually call it a race engine it's actually set up slightly different to a base turbo engine okay so it's mapped on v-power there's only one map is there any like can you switch the boost or it's, anything you or? can switch the boost because this is on a standard boost mm -hmm. at 510 right for reliability reasons mm -hmm. uh, you can upgrade the boost to 800 horsepower yeah but <laughs> Jeez, yeah, yeah, I think that's right, yeah. <laughs> now, but you know what? It's funny because I put up a post the other day, yeah, and the second fastest car in the country is yeah. an MR2. Really, yeah, I it's believe got, it like, with about a thousand brakes. I believe it's quicker, it. it's quicker than my GTR. Wow, so I don't know if you've seen my GTR, I've got like crazy seriously? power and it's half, wow. yeah, yeah, no, seriously, wow. yeah. But anyway, so the car also runs meth, yes, it runs yeah. meth. I mean, for example, if it runs out, can you still you can still drive it? You yeah, can still, it's, yeah, it's mainly for cooling, just cooling, yeah, yeah for okay. cooling. It's got a thousand cc injectors as well. So yeah, Garrett the, Turbo as well, Garrett Turbo. When does the turbo kick in? Like, pretty quick? About or? three and a half thousand revs. Jeez. Yeah. Does it spin up straight away? Oh, sp trust me. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. um, okay, so what about suspension and stuff like that? Suspense. Brakes, wheels and... Yeah, so brakes-wise, it's got the yellow stuff, brake pads, BC coilovers. BC coilovers, nice. Yeah, lowered 40 mil all the way around. So on the road, it's like soaks up the bumps nice? Yes. Improves handling yes, as well? Yes, definitely. Yeah, BC coilovers. Yeah, good. stage three racing clutch. Okay. That can be tricky. Right. What is the biting point right at the end? Or? Yeah, uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Is it heavy Very as well? Or? Very heavy. Okay. Let's have a little look in the interior, man. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. You've got the big, like, sort of center console there, innit? Like, yeah. separating the driver and the passenger. Yeah. And you've got the scoop here as well, man. Oh, guys, this car just looks so sick. Look, mid engined. It's a beaut, man. So, uh, yeah, wait, should we jump out? Yeah. Yeah? yeah let's, let's do it, man.
Guys, check out the latest composition car, the 660 horsepower BMW M4. You can literally win it for just £4.99. Now, most of you will know that this whole LLF Games journey began with my own personal M4, but I can tell you the spec on this thing actually trumps my car. So, firstly, this car has been built by a Volvo Automotive with over £30,000 in modifications. Starting off with Pure Stage 2 hybrid turbochargers, it's running Bilstein suspension, upgraded 20 inch alloy wheels. We've got upgraded AP racing radical brakes i'll never be able to go over the full spec in this video but we've got a varo carbon fiber we've got the sunroof option seven speed dual clutch transmission and this car runs no meth no ethanol no race fuel literally v power 99 run 660 horsepower ticket link in the description where you can get the full spec on this car and i'll put you back into the video let's go wayne let's go what are you telling me whoa you ready i'm ready man man's F1 out here as well, yeah? Yep. You're in that guy, it's Formula One. Formula One. Yeah, test driver. Yeah, I wish, man. <laughs> Oi, yeah, that's about to come in. Yeah, about to come oh, look in. Look at the dials, man, they look sick. So retro, isn't it? Yeah, so old school, I love it. So raw, just ready. Proper mm. driver's car. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look at the wheel. You say you've owned this for how long again? So a couple of months now. A couple of months, yeah. yeah. And you say you've had Bentleys, R rates? R rates, M6, M6. Uh, convertible, wow. uh, CR63. Over 80 cars, me and my brother counted that. 80 I cars? Over 80, and that was a couple years ago. <laughs> yeah, 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 the Porsche. And you're in the MR2 now? The MR2, always Bro, come back did, did to the you hearing this? Like, always that's a big back. statement right yeah. there. Feel that little sway at the yeah, back yeah. there, isn't it? Reminding you, man, rear wheel drive, real yeah. driver's cars. Yeah. What tires are on the rear again? So they are Hankook's V12s. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. On the rear. Yeah. And yeah. Rain Sport 2s at the front. Has it been temperamental, but has it? Have you Do you know what? I've had no issues at all. Uh, the way the engine set up, obviously, when you start it in the morning, it. you can't you can't even drive it because the car would just stall. Oh, okay. So yeah. you mean it's got some sort so of you, safety yes, parameters? Give it ten minutes as long as it's. Up to optimum temperature, then you. What, it won't even let you pull off? It won't, won't even you, let you no, cruise it? No. Okay, it's just gotta be warm. Bloody <laughs> hell, yeah, that's, a, that's a serious pull, guys. Uh, power brutal. to weight is power yeah, to weight, isn't it? Yeah, 510 brutal. horsepower, 1200 kilos. Absolutely brutal. That is brutal, yeah. Brutal. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, that's like strong when it comes to Is there anything done to the gearbox? Yeah, so they've rebuilt the gearbox. They did say they've actually rebuilt the gearbox okay. to make it strong to handle the power. Right. The guy I spoke to sold me the car, said it's built for 700 pounds per foot torque. Oh, wow. Yeah, and currently this car's running 500 pounds per foot torque. So, yeah. so it's like a reliable, like you say, container. Yeah, reliable, yeah. Like yeah, if definitely. you want to push it. So how did you get working at Formula One, man, uh, Williams? Well, before that, I was working at a company called Dyson. Right. I don't know Dyson with the vacuum. From a young age, I've mm. been into my cars. Always right. had posters, you know, young boys have posters on their walls and yeah, yeah, everything. Yeah. And I've always loved Formula One, always. And I said, one day I'm going to work for a Formula One team. So I just worked myself away, worked myself wow. up, and did everything I could. And, you know. Williams. Williams. And you've been there since 2015? 2015. You man. Yeah. Respect, man. Yeah, thanks, man. Respect. Man. Turbo's right there, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. It's just so cool to be in something yeah. like old school. Yeah. It's like this bit of peace that comes, like, memories yeah. of being a bit younger, yeah. you know? Well, how much does it cost for a full tank? I think it was 56 pounds. So it hasn't got a huge tank. Sounded NA for a sec then. Yeah. <laughs> Oi. It's just that the sound, it's just so addictive. <laughs> it's weird, like, what's it? How does that power come in? It comes in like an Evo. Yeah. You know, like a, some of the stroked Evos I've been out in. Yeah. It's just like that. What does it rev to? It revs to 7,000, but I think it's revs past that, to be fair. Bro, that power band is yeah. just like an yeah. Evo. Yeah. And then, boom, next. 
mad. That's, crazy. that's that's a very intense power. Yeah, like, yes. like I can tell you from all of the car. That's a like yeah. That's a strong, strong yeah. power, man. Yeah. I've had a lot of cars with more power than this, but mm -hmm. as you said, it comes to power to weight. Yeah. Because yeah, this, power to this weight, is like the same power to weight as a Ventador. Yeah. And a 911 GT2. How come you're specifically into MR2s then? Do you know what? It's just a it's just a mid engine. I love where the engine is in yeah. the back. I just love how balanced the car is. I know before they had problems with snap over steer, but as, as time gone on, I've got the one of the later ones. It's just the way mid engine, rear wheel drive. It's the way it handles. It's the way it performs. Mm -hmm. And as I said, having the engine behind you, listening to that turbo, mm -hmm. it's amazing. Guys, it don't get more retro than this, man. If you can see the switches I'm seeing right now, like look how upright this handbrake is. It's madness. Like I just jumped into a game or something. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's a heavy clutch, boy. Hey, man's in the 2.2 <laughs> stroke car. Yes. Steering looks nice, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, yeah, got to be smooth with that clutch, yeah. isn't it? Man, listen to this, guys. <laughs> Wow, it's uh, very responsive, the turbo, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. I'm barely touching the throttle right now, yeah, and it's just, just man, look at the driving position. Look, gear stick right there, my arm's length here. Definitely built for the driver. But... Bro, that's a very quick spooling turbo, yeah. man. Five-speed, or? Yeah, five-speed box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it feels agile, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. You can agile. feel the fact it's rear-wheel drive, actually. Yeah. You know, first time ever driving one. First time, yeah. That's what I reached out to you really. It's nice that you can actually drive this and, and see for yourself what it's like. And I know, as I said before, there's a couple out there with the K20 swap. K20, yeah. such a good engine. Okay. Let's go. Wow. 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 <laughs> Man. Yeah, turning's effortless. Yeah. Third gear. Build a boost, 4,000. This is just like an Evo. Lord. Wow. Sitting in the passenger seat. I know everyone <laughs> says the same thing, but it is different. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, it's your car, isn't it? Yo, your wow. pride and joy. But I mean, it's very challenging to drive. It's yeah. not an, yeah, it's it's not not an effectless easy. drive. No, it's definitely like, I not. I feel like I've got to adapt and learn how to yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, drive it more efficiently. Man, you've got to drive the car, you like you said. You have to drive the car. You can't just smash through the gearbox. Yeah, yeah. But it does feel tight, stable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jeez, I'm hearing the little crunch there. It's because I'm not getting the clutch down. I've got to be. You got to almost be a, be a step ahead of yes, yourself. I think uh, you can't be like super aggressive. With it. Yeah. So when be... I first drove it, I just had to take time just to learn it. Wow. Wow. Man, that second gear wow. is something else. <laughs> This is so engaging, man. It's completely wow. different to like the Supra. It's literally its own wow. own thing, isn't it? <laughs> oh, man, this is sick. As I say, definitely an event, isn't it? Now, the fact is, rear wheel drive. Look at the traction we're getting. Yeah, that's what I'm traction saying. Traction's awesome. Those tires are really good for this car. I was actually surprised because when I saw it. When the guy told me what sort of tyres he had on there, I said, I'm going to change those straight away. But when I actually put the power down, I thought, wow. Bro, that is, that is some serious yes, power. Yeah. God, look at the traction. I don't know about here. Wow. Yeah, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, you got to respect it, bro. Yeah, definitely. you got to respect you this, man. You have know what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, it's a heavy wheel, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, once you get going, it, it turns effortlessly, but yeah. at slower speeds, this wheel gets kind of weighty, like yes. there now it's, so I'm saying that in a positive way, it's raw boy, yeah. you got the LSD, yeah. still got drivability man, yeah, exactly. that's the main thing, sometimes you can go a bit too big, yeah that's right, with the turbo you know, that's right. like the roads we're on now, yeah, it's not making me want to push it, it feels like it's a little, a little too fast, yeah, <laughs> for the road, yeah, yeah. yeah. but because of the involvement as well required yeah. to actually yeah. get the performance out of it, exactly. It's like, you know what, I'll just give it a miss, bro. <laughs> look at that, it's on. Wow, bro, 
this is like, I'm sweating a bit, yeah, man. Yeah, same. I'm telling you, every it's time testing, you come, it's, think. A, it's a workout in itself. <laughs> yeah. Brakes feel good. I definitely get the hype now. I mean, I've always suspected that the hype was real. I've seen many of them growing up, like yeah. some sick ones, and this is like, yeah, I'm grateful to actually no, be able to get no, out of no it. Problem, so I've got a taste of what it's like. Yeah, it's no problem. You know, it's a privilege more choices now yeah, when, yeah, I, when definitely. I want to get a car. Um, no overheating, it's no all good. Nothing, nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. Like you say, the engine's built for seven, 800 horsepower. Yeah, yeah that's it. It's, it's built, it's what built you say, 700 foot pounds of torque. We're running yep. 500 brake, 500 foot pounds. Yep. Enjoyed that, man. Really enjoyed oh, it. Oh, good, good, good. I'm glad you did, man. And where are you from? Uh, Gloucester, you said? Gloucester, yeah. Gloucester. Yeah, nice, man. You've got a car. And uh, what do you reckon? You're going to have this one? Do you reckon it's ever going to go? You reckon you're going to keep it's, it? You know what? I don't even know. There's times I say I want to sell it. Right. Because. Uh, I buy and sell as well. Oh shit, uh, yeah, you yeah. buy and sell cars, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, as well. So, how long so, you been doing that then? Uh, for a long time now, probably over 10 years. But yeah, guys, this is what you want, man. You want a car that isn't easy to drive. Like, yeah, I'm not going to say it's got flaws, but yeah. a car with flaws is cool. Like, yeah. you don't want a car that's absolutely yeah, perfect. perfect. Yeah. That's when right. it becomes effortless and just like whatever, driving yeah. it one fingered. Like, yeah. obviously, it's because of the mods why, why it's more difficult to pull off, but it's more of an event when you go out, man. Trust me. Yeah. yeah. Respect, Wayne. Yeah, no thank problem Thank you so at much all. for no coming down. No problem Thank you. Thank you for the opportunity. Yeah, I rate the car highly, yeah. highly. <laughs> Love it. I don't know if you have any social media, any sort of links you want to leave, or I don't know, anyone you want to shout out, maybe. Uh, I want to shout out King's Performance in Blackpool because you've done an excellent job with this car. Really, really good. Social media-wise, uh, John Wayne 14 um, That's on Instagram. Instagram, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. It, that's it. Well, uh, yeah, I'll leave all them links in the description. I'll yeah. obviously get them from you afterwards. And uh, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And if you've got something cool that you want to see on the channel, got any friends with a cool car, um, get in touch, man. All my details are in the description. You can send me an email. You can message me on Instagram or Facebook. I'm bang on these features as you would have probably seen over the last few weeks. So yeah, guys, I'm out.